Hey guys, it's me Melissa and welcome back to my channel and welcome back to Timu Monday! Our favorite day of the week, my favorite day of the week. Today we are finishing off the orange. The orange bags, the last orange box. It's time. It's time to go out with the old and in with the new. <laughs> if you would say, I also found while I find this box, I found a whole clothing haul that I got a while back where everything was under $3. So I think that's gonna be the next video. Um, obviously, probably the prices aren't the same. They were all like lightning deals, but will not that be fun? Under $3? Can't be that. And as always, I, all the items that are still available, which might not be all of them, because obviously I bought these a long time ago, orange boxes, orange bag. Which I don't really think doing boxes anymore. I would love to get a white box. Dreams. So all the links to everything that's still available will be down below. Also, there'll be a link and a code to get yourself for new and existing users a $100 coupon bundle. Any savings you can get is always great. So like we have the big box, which have legit no clue what's in it. Have a bag over here, which I'm pretty sure is all games and game related stuff. And then I'm fast tracking one item. <laughs> so I got this kind of recently and I wanted to fast track it. So did I write how much it is? So this one is $12.27. I don't know if I'm able to even get into this. It's like the worst styrofoam. My least favorite styrofoam in the world. I think it's just it's on all sides. As you know before, I got this thing for my drinks. And I wanted to be able to like let my spout or my crystal light rock at all times instead of picking up the big picture since my thing's at the top. And it's done good, but I, I feel like it's not big enough. Like I want a bigger one. So this is what I got. Is it bigger? Where's all the pieces? Do I need to clean it? Get rid of the styrofoam. So let me get this all situated first before we get into our orange-a-thon and then yeah, we'll see if this works better. I'll bring the other one over and we'll kind of go from there. Okay, so here's the old one that I had in there from Timu. And then here's the new one. This one would fill up, but I feel like I could have cut the crystal light. Like I could have used half to pack it. And then made the new packet where I feel like I could do the full packet in here and fill it all the way up and it'll be the perfect amount. Now, one-handedly, <laughs> let's try to do this. There we go. And it stops good. This one stops, but like leaves a little bit of like a remnant. This one stops pretty good. Might like hit it a little bit. This one came with a wrench to kind of make it sure it was really, really tight back here. Now I'm not saying this one isn't good if you want a small amount of stuff, but if you want like a large, like a full pitcher, if not more of a full pitcher, I would choose the bigger one. And that'll be linked down below. So I'm very happy about that. Also from the last video, the little butt lifting things, I'm currently wearing them right now. I would say they kind of feel like the booty ones you put on when you're trying to like soften your feet so they don't really stick. So I had to wear like full underwear and try to like keep it on there. So I'm going to leave it on for the whole video. I left it on, it's probably been on for an hour now. So maybe by the end of this video, we'll kind of just see if I feel firmer or not. <laughs> I'm a sucker for the like, hey, instantly tighten, instantly lose weight, instantly this. Now this box definitely has a little bit of a <laughs> crack in it, so this probably will be used for Poshmark. I'll probably just get rid of this one. So we got in here, oh, Slow Mountain DIY Experimental Explosion. So this side has like snow, and then this side has like lava. I got this to bring to Rhode Island for us to do with J.R. and Jackson. It is $3.98, it's like called Science Fun. Do experiments on your own. I mean, I'm not going to open it up, take a little look, see what, see what is inside of here. Like I said, I'm not going to do it now because I know a lot of times I'll buy two of some things. We could do it together and then, but that can get expensive. <laughs> so we have our little, oh, this is a little tiny little thing. And then, oh, I guess you do both. So you have to, you have to do both variants and no instructions. Oh, yes. Just kidding. So the instructions are on the side. So that's thought it would be a fun thing to do together with Jaron Jackson because they are the older of my cousin's kids. So I feel like something a little more educational might be good for them. So I got that. Oh, God forbid more, more uh, slides. 
God forbid. <laughs> so these are 38.39s and I paid two dollars and eighty-seven cents, which makes me funny because like some of these I got for like ninety-seven cents. So why would I have paid two eighty-seven? I am I have been usually selling these at the flea market for four dollars, but sometimes people get them for three dollars, which isn't that much really making much money for these ones. 38.39, no 39.40. So that's like a eight nine. Hopefully that's the last one. <laughs> so, oh, so now we have another piece of clothing. But as we know, we're doing clothing later on. Is there a bunch of clothing here? We'll see how much clothing is in there. Maybe, maybe it will be a clothing haul at the end. Maybe we'll combo it up. <laughs> I mean, it is in the green. It, it is in the orange one. So I did throw orange ones over there. So yeah, clothing item. We'll put that over here. See how many we have. Clothing item. All right, these were $1.79. When we were having our little kind of problemo with the fruit flies. I ordered these. Now we've gotten it under control. But these are like constant sticky things you can hang and then bugs will stick to it and then you can rinse it off and reuse it. I know it sounds gross but oh well. <laughs> So I got these, like I said, we got it under control now through, I bought so many different things. And it's not just like we're dirty in our house because the neighbor's like two doors down, next door neighbor has them, two doors down has them. So I don't know if like somebody has them in their house and they kind of travel through the pipes to all of us. I don't know. Then, oh, I was saying what I was going to find then. So this is, I don't know if you've been on cruises and people hide ducks. I really don't know why. They'll make Facebook groups for the duck and then whatever. So this is $12.87. How many did you get? 60 pieces. Oh, 60 pieces including the cards. So we usually go carnival. So this thing has a carnival thing on it. Cards. And you can write if you're going to put it on Facebook or going to do anything with it. You can also put like a note on it, which we're going to put. Our, our goal is every time we went on a cruise, there's a thing inside a carnival where you put in, you do credit, and you can grab a duck. So no matter what, you're winning a duck. And every time we would bring Paco back, a duck. And he always loved the little ducks. So, and as you know, one time I got him a big advent calendar with ducks. So he loved the ducks. So we thought in memory of Paco, we, on our next cruise, which will be in March, for actually Rob's birthday, and it comes with a little tie you put on too, um, we're going to hide these around the ship in memory of Paco. So that's what, I've never done this stuff before. I'm not, you know, I found ducks before for sure. But I thought that these were cute. They kind of have a theme of some like pirates and like ship people and stuff. So I thought that would be awesome to bring in our next cruise. Like I said, in memory of Paco to kind of like keep his uh, legacy alive. I don't know. Like I said, every time we went, we got him a duck. So this is kind of a way to give back for Paco. What are you? $3.48. This, this, this time, guys, complete mystery. Oh, so I bought another. So, I'm always kind of trying out new things. This one is another, like, tripod type holder for your phone, which should be my phone fine, but also has the capability to move sideways, I believe. Yes. So you can move it sideways if you want. Can you do anything else with it? No. I guess you can move it down a little bit and it back a little bit. And that's gonna be horrible to get back in. And it kind of slides into something. I don't know. Like I said, I'm trying out different stuff over time. I'm buying a bunch of different kind of camera esque type stuff to see what might work better for me. Ooh. Okay, so I got this a dollar and 97 cents and this six dollars and 29 cents for my bag that um ivy sent me in one of my mystery boxes oh the bag is full right now but i'm gonna empty it bring it over we're gonna put this stuff in it and i'm gonna show you how cool it is so i know you've seen these bags um i had no clue until i went to rhode island my cousin told me that these are knockoffs from something else but they are cool bags this is the bag that i'm using now a lot of times to bring stuff upstairs she said that she would loved it for like a beach bag. I forgot to tell you the big pack was $6.20. So you have these little, I guess like gibbets. Gibbets? 
and you can just stick them in. So you can like hold stuff. And I figured it'd be good if I'm bringing a bunch of different things upstairs, I could have different hooks. I don't know. I guess I just hook in. So these are all like little bags. Like say I'm bringing a bunch of like little jewelry upstairs. This one's zippered. This one's zippered too. So I guess you can put it outside or inside. Like say I'm bringing a bunch of stuff upstairs. Let me take these out. I'm going to put it on the outside just to kind of like give you a just of it. So you just click them right in the holes. That one's a little harder than I was expected. All right, so you click them in the little holes and then you can use the thing for extra added room. I'm guessing the best thing you would do is put it inside, but I'm just putting it on the outside just to show you. I'll put one on the inside too. Boom, boom, boom. Boom, boom, boom. See, so you got little bags inside your bag and even this bag too. I almost wish they had them on the side also. The real ones have them on the side or just the, the the other thing so yeah so this is a neat way to be able to bring other stuff upstairs kind of separated like smaller items than the bigger items so super sure about that i think this was for like hanging stuff on i feel like it doesn't it like moves around a little bit. like these are a little bit bigger than the other ones i don't know yay <laughs> excited about that i don't know where they where they were <laughs> Clothing item, clothing, clothing. I may end up just grabbing another, another um bag if we. <laughs> this is too short. Two dollars and twenty-seven cents. I got size large. Oh, this is the thing you're supposed to wear to make you keep your shoulders back. What way do you wear it? I bought one a long time ago, and these things hurt so bad. I'm going to leave it on for the video. A lot of times when I sleep, I keep doing this. So I've now propped myself on two pillows to keep myself back because it makes my upper back and my neck hurt so bad that I was wondering if it would be better if I tried to keep myself back as much in the day as possible. So I got this to try to like maybe even wear under my work shirt. Or wear around the house a lot of times even when i'm on the couch watching tv i'm kind of like slouching i don't feel like this is painful whereas the other one was really painful it was more of a plasticky type where this is definitely soft and stretchable we'll leave it on more things that polos never got anything to do with <laughs> this was two dollars and 38 cents and they had pictures of cats wearing little crocs We did end up getting, I don't know if I spilled the picture, we did end up getting, if I have it, I'll put it up, Polo in that homie G outfit for like five seconds. Like he was not having it. I don't think he's going to be an outfit guy. <laughs> but if I have the picture, I'll put it up right here so you guys can see it. But he looks a little clock. I mean, work comes to worse, even if he doesn't wear these, these are cute little, tiny little Crocs. Like that's a cute little like miniature item, I would call it. <laughs> This is 98 cents, and that's why I bought it. <laughs> There's really no rhyme or reason for this one. I feel like it did get a little smushed. Let me see if I can bend it. Oh, it broke a little bit. It got smushed and broke a little bit, but... Oh, God. No, princess. <laughs> I'm so random with my purchases, and especially the fact of, like, realizing later on what I purchased. I'm just like, okay, Melissa. <laughs> this, 98 cents. I think I got this from Rob. This is a wire cutter, I believe. And one day he was looking for a wire cutter, and we were searching through all of our tools. And I think we have one somewhere. But that thing we have all our stuff in the back is a hot mess. So I got him for this. Little thing, probably cute and he can carry with him. Not take a lot of room. And get all the trash off of here. 
This I also got for J.R. and Jackson, $1.99. They had so much fun last year with the blow up um, instruments. We actually even did the blow up like instrument jam out in the car going away to our other um, cousin's house. So I got this blow up boom box. <laughs> you can even do like the put it on her shoulder and they like, jam out. So I got them this. I thought it'd be funny. Um, yet again, I don't think that this year I'm going to be able to bring all the stuff up I have now because there's more. So guessing it's going to be multiple years for these kids to be getting good gifts. Clothing item. This was $4.38 and I thought maybe if I got one that really looked realistic that Rob would wear it. <laughs> so we shall see. This one actually says Captain on it. It, this is the most looking legit one that I've gotten so far. It almost it looks like a baseball cap in the back. So it's adjustable. Like I said, this is the most realistic one I've gotten. I'm hoping he'll wear it just for like a little bit. I mean, I always tell him like nobody, like I don't care. And nobody, nobody cares about you. Actually, they'll get a little giggle off of this. You'll probably make their day by seeing you wear. And I've seen for sure people on cruises wearing captain's hats. So this is like I said. The most legit one I could possibly find. So we shall see. That'll be up to March and see what he thinks. I do feel like this is kind of making me stay up more. Which is good because I need to. The old, plus, like, the older you get, I think the more you slouch. Now, this was 98 cents. And these were the little cat fighting things. I already bought these before. Polo was not a big fan. So I'm working on a... Polo reject box, so this will probably go in that too. I know a lot of people's cats do love them, but cats are finicky. Like, they like what they like, and they don't like what they don't like. And that's it. Another pair of flip-flops. So I got another pair of slides. These were $3.97. Size 38, 39. Did I get it for me? $38.39. For me. I know a lot of you guys say that you hate the slides and you think they're ugly, but I love them. I love them. I wore slides almost the whole entire time in on the cruise in Italy for Italy and Greece. I, I pick a slide any day now over a flip-flop thong in between my toe. So much more comfortable. So yes, I got some more. Now I've got all white ones. These are kind of like cream ones. Oh, this is for the thingy too. This is a divider. Now I get the thing again. So this is $6.78. It's a divider thing. Oh, they're in the ground already. I'm going to have to go get it. BRB. Here you go. So you got a little divider. The only thing I feel weird is there was like only five. One, two, three, four, five clips where I feel like there should have been six clips unless one fell out. I don't think I can use. I might have bought other clips to go with things. I can't remember. I mean, I still feel like it's fine. It's still gonna like separate stuff inside of there. Who knew? I didn't even know there was accessories for the thing until Jessica told me. That's why I looked them up. <laughs> it goes on your sliding glass door to make it look like there's a cat there, like peeking through, but kind of like in that stained glass kind of look. This was 98 cents. I mean, come on, let's put it on. <laughs> there you go. Isn't that cute? I guess you can put it anywhere you want on it. I mean, the outside of my sliding glass door is dirty. But it's also a hot mess out there with all the flea market stuff. <laughs> so, but that's cute, right? I can't wait till Rob sees it. I'm not going to mention it and see if he mentions it, he sees it. But that's cute. I like it. You look adorable. I wonder what Polo will think of you. So cute. All right, moving on. Clothing item. Clothing item. Clothing item. Oh my gosh. Clothing item, clothing item. Poof. 98 cents. I got this a long time ago for the cruise. The last cruise. Because I wanted to bring like, a cheap one with me and then just leave it. So I guess now I have one for the next cruise because I the last one I... I ended up buying it on Walmart for, I think, a dollar. can more than a dollar. So I had this for 98 cents. This we brought on the next cruise for me to use. And then I would just leave it there. I like to do that with poofs and 
toothbrushes. Lint remover. $5.98. It was like a plug-in. I got this. Is it rechargeable? I guess it's rechargeable. I mainly got this for like when I get thrift store clothes or I think some storage units or something like that and I want to like make them look a little bit better. I don't know what I... Can I do it on my shirt and see what happens? I mean, it's not messing up my shirt. If you got that, let me know. <laughs> If you've gotten this, the metal is a little shifty right here. <laughs> we'll see how long it lasts. But let her, I got, got it just for like doing, like fixing things a little bit, I guess. All right. Are you over the, I'm kind of over that now. <laughs> Maybe I'll give that to the neighbor girl. Maybe I can try to like hot glue this little piece together and then give it to the little neighbor girl. I think she would love that. Also, this is getting a little annoying to me, so I might take that off now. But it does give you a good little bit of time. You can keep yourself back a little bit. Maybe it'll kind of, maybe if you did it for like 15 minutes a day or 20 minutes a day, then it'll start to train you to stay up a little bit better. Insoles. $2.67. Do they for me or Rob? I guess me. I guess me. What did I get them for? Made my work shoes, see if they work better. They have those nice little, like, things at the bottom. May as well try them out. <laughs> Never know what I'm buying, guys. Oh, this is the other hat I was looking for. $2.38. I had the gray one with me when I went on the cruise, but I did not, but I wanted the black one. I used the gray one a couple times, but I wanted the black one. <laughs> so here's the black one. Kind of a wider brim. Don't have to worry about wearing sunglasses because you kind of got the shade. Um, this may even be better. I had those little short ones that I forgot, like a spandexy material. And they had a really short brim. So I feel like this might be better for like a wider brim for like when we go to Grand Turk and Amber Cove when we get in the pool we're sitting in the pool for a while I don't, if I don't have to wear sunglasses I probably would rather not wear sunglasses plus I have to worry always about this getting burnt so that's a good way to cover it up another thing for polo 98 cents it's not around yeah so we're slowly trying out all different types of things to see which things make him the happiest what we, since I have so many like boxes over there of like 88 lot stuff, we stick them in between the boxes and then see which one he goes for. He loves that little ribbon one and he has played with the other one, but this is another one I got him. We'll see. He's nowhere to be found. We can't help you there. Intelligent face massager. Reshape del delicate V face. How much is this? Nine dollars and ninety-seven cents, Melissa. See, I get suckered in to like make me look young easily without having to do anything. Oh, it comes a strap. Does have this? Is it like? Is it? I have a feeling and a charger. Question is, does it work currently without charging it, or will I have to give you an update on the next video? Let me figure it out. So here it is, it's on, but I can't get it to do much, so I'm thinking maybe it's not fully charged. It's like it's like a tens machine. So you wear it and it's gonna like but I kinda like how I don't have to like hold it on. So I'm gonna have to update you 
either in a short or another video because I really can't feel anything. I think this is the up button. Oh, wait. Leave it to Max. I do feel something. It's not intense. There's a button at the bottom, too. Is that the different modes? I do feel it. It's very mild, though. Are you working? Are you thinning my face as we speak? All right, so I'm gonna do a little more research on this and either get back to you in the next video or the next video that's not maybe clothing and go from there. It is comfortable wear though. Off, get you fully charged. <laughs> this I thought was funny, it's $2.48. I got this because a lot of my clients always say like that they have a hard time putting on like doing their eyebrows or doing things that are up close because it's hard to do one eye at a time. So these, they should. I don't know how. Oh, they go like this. So you can move it, and it's got a neck of plus two. definitely a lot closer so it's weird looking from far away but I was like oh it's a way you could like literally be able to do your things you need to do using one eye and looking with the other eye that was my thought <laughs> I bought two of these two dollars no four dollars and seventy eight cents Oh, these are the bras! Yes! Yes, yes, yes. The thing I bought before that I said I was going to use for the bras, I don't like it. For bras. It's a great item. I just don't like it for bras. Maybe all over the house today. <laughs> so this you can hang individual bras on. And I bought two of them. And then you can kind of see exactly what your bras are. Yes. And then I've shown you these before. I guess I bought three more of these. Like I needed three more. Three more of these to put your pants on. I probably use one more. I guess you never know if one's gonna break. Of course I write pray. Oh, these were three dollars and thirty-nine cents each. We've already seen these upstairs. I showed you guys them. So now we're gonna go and I'm gonna do my bras. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Let's see if this is a game changer or not. I'll show you what I'm working with now what I did, and then we'll see if this is a game changer or not. So I don't know if you guys remember when I got this. Now it's only perfect for bras, but it really isn't. It's perfect for a million things, just not really bras. So let's see if we can change this around and make it magical. So here we go, guys. Didn't realize I had this many bras. <laughs> Night and day. I'm able to find every single bra I'm looking for as soon as I want it. Hopefully it'll make me also want to put it back in the right spot. Each time I take it out, I'm not going to get rid of the other things. Like, I'll save them probably for the new house, but yes. So I am very happy with that. Um, today's an exhausting video. I'm all over the place. we got a few more items in here. Ooh, these are 98 cents. I got these with a lot of my, you know the ones in the cabinets that come with the cabinets? They're like a foamy type S1. At least mine came with that. This house is like 18 years old. So I'm going to replace all the ones that have fallen off with these little ones so the cabinets will have more, less bang when they close. Oh, here's the one. <laughs> this, $2.49. And this, I don't know, they had so many of these. So I bought them because I was like, oh, do these things break a lot? Or 
can use this for other things, but I guess you only need it if the big ones break. Like they're holding on the straps. I guess I have backups. <laughs> and the last thing in here, in the box, $2.48 and it's another tripod phone holder accessory. So this one does the whole where you can turn it, put it any way you want. And then this one, which is, this is kind of more like the one I have right now. But I feel like the one I have right now is getting a little wobbly. So this might be the new one I put on there on my tripod. So that's that. So that is that for the box. But we still got a bag. Now, this one right here. One dollar and forty-six cents. Comes with all these balls. And this right here works. I guess you can just hang it with a hook. I guess you can just tape it on if you wanted to. As you know, when my family comes, I always like to play silly, stupid games with them. I'm glad I'm getting to this because they're coming for Thanksgiving. Well, after Thanksgiving they'll be coming here. And you just what? Does the ball go in there? Where do you hold? Here? Can I just aim for that thing? That can be deadly. This can be deadly if you use it for something else. <laughs> but I have a whole thing, whatever I can actually get to it. <laughs> a whole, like, bench seat. That opens up and it's pretty much filled with games. So whatever I can get in there, I'm mean, adding all these games to it. So this would be a fun one for us to do. I don't remember if I said how much it was, but I think it's gone now. It's gone. <laughs> oh, this one. I thought this was hilarious. Yeah, I'm just gonna take one out. These were not together. You had to buy them separately. Seven dollars and nineteen cents. Hopefully it's still available, and I'm gonna put I can put a picture up of it. But I'm gonna kind of just give you the gist. Oh no, this one's broken. Oh no, way too late for me to get a refund. Might be trying to use some hot glue. Look. <laughs> so a piece broke off. What you do is you put this strap around you, and then your goal is try to get. Like you put it on you and then you try to uh, so it straps here and here right did i lose my strap spot from the oh from the break i have to just figure this back out get that back in there if i can if i can't it is what it is when you use one person at a time doing it but then you try to throw like the person will throw balls at you and you've got to try to catch them with your back, like with your butt on your back. So we'll have to fix that. If not, we have one, one person can play at a time. Not a huge deal. Got tons of balls. Cole usually likes balls. So we got that. Nothing there. Did something fall out? This is just silly too. They were 98 cents each. And it's just a ring toss. But miniature. Because I also like to have games we can play, like, on the table. I guess you make it different heights, too. So you put this in here. And then your goal, obviously, is just to... I won't get it. Forget it. Forget it. <laughs> the goal is try to get the things on the thing like that. <laughs> so I have two sets of them. So we have two like people going against each other to see it go. But ninety eight cents a piece. Like I said, these are things that are just silly but yet also fun for people to do and inexpensive. 
Oh, this isn't even a toy. I mean, it isn't even a game. $3.09. I know you've probably seen these. I figure this is like the legit cutest way to have out chip clips. So the fry container is cardboard. It has a magnet on the back. I guess you can also hook it if you want to. And then inside are all the little chip clips. So the fries are actually chip clips. If I've seen these a million times, I know you've seen them too. How adorable is that? Adorable. It's fries and then don't in England they call them chips instead of fries. <laughs> I got this for Polo, <laughs> 89 cents. Man, it's be hard to find these, all these, uh, things. It's just a carrot. It's got, like, crinkly stuff at the top. He's not down here. Oh, and I also got these again. So they're $4.98, and it says 39 even though I'm a 38. Rob just impromptuly came home from work, which is not a normal thing for him to do. <laughs> um, and these are the ones, that, these foam ones, I love them so much. Not only because they're a foam, but they're also got like squishy here. So it gives you like a little bit of support when you're walking. So I love mine so much. And I said, just in case, I'm going to order them again. And they're a little slippery at the bottom. You just go outside, rub them on the concrete a little bit. Boom, good to go. I wore these a lot on the last cruise. I've worn these on every cruise. They're just so comfortable. Hopefully they're still available. And then the last item in here, which I guess is the final item for today. I'll have to check and see where we are time-wise. But this is Tetris the game. So instead of playing it, uh, is there like any type of game you can play Tetris? I don't think there is. I think that, so I mean, I guess, you play by yourself or you play with other people and you have your little ways to make i mean how could you mess up though i mean i guess you can still make mistakes but i feel like if you knew which one to put where you wouldn't have a problem unless they can like shift or something in there i'm gonna try to do a few and see if i can get them i don't know in a line as i was putting all the red ones in i realized that inside of one of these there is a thing to spin or to roll so that is how you make it more difficult where you're going to put things i just use all the reds so this could be a good fun game to play by yourself or play with others you need to go like back no i think you went back to fourth i guess where the last one would be wrong maybe it's a game to play by yourself pull the planet plastic again so i thought during this time i was like you know what i'm not going to do all the clothing today i'm going to save the clothing for not the next haul because that'll be the one with the three dollar one, but there's gonna be plenty of clothing hauls. Do not worry about it. So I grab one more bag. <laughs> I grab another bag. I have no clue what's in it, as always with every single one. First thing I'm pulling out. Oh, LED wash repair magnifiers. So I wear at work when I'm doing extractions. I wear this little headset, and it this has lights too, right? I'm having a party over there. Oh my god. Can you make it? Oh god, what happened? No. <laughs> so there's like different things on top of this. Well, this might be, this might be too magnified. How do you turn the lights on? Are the lights still there? Is there lights? Where do you put batteries in? Lights come on. There, look, there's lights. I can't see anything. Oh man, you'd have to have it like this close. I'm not gonna even close somebody's face. What about with this piece on? I can't see anything. How do I get back on? Oh god. <laughs> Let me hold it. Oh man, it has to be like this close. <laughs> to see, it has to be this close on that one. This close on that one. Yeah, that's going to be too close for me for work. I guess if I did need this for... Oh. 
How did I turn those on? How did I turn them on? Oh, this side. But I mean, it said wash repair. So I'm guessing if you are doing something extremely intricately close. Oh, this does move. In the picture, it moved. These move too? Oh, they do. <laughs> These also move. You can get completely even out of the way if you're doing something and then kind of move back to it. Kind of thing. Maybe I had it too close to my eye. Let's try it a little farther away. Nope, so right here. <laughs> so yeah, this will be good if you want something extremely gosh darn close. That you're trying to work on watch batteries, <laughs> watch cleaning, watch thing. Oh, I broke on the floor. Maybe not completely up my alley for what I need. Will it ever need to look like that close to something? My eyes hurt. I don't think so. Will Rob ever need to look that close to something? I'm looking for the red there because I don't know if I want to do that today. <laughs> what is this? Oh, this is a, a ventless neck fan. This is another purchase for possibly the flea market compared to the ones that... I think somebody recommended this to me. I have that one that has the things that pull out and they blow the fan blows at you. But I was told that this one's better. Comes with a charger. Alright, so we got different... Oh, look. <laughs> it's just like that. And I lost the button. Found it. All right, that's a max. I mean, being indoors right now, I feel like this is cooler than the other one. And also, I don't have to have it shooting at my face. I can just have it like this. Let's get it out if you wanted to, too. Even farther amount of... Hopefully I'm not yelling. This is, and, this, and this is actually more comfortable. So I do thank whoever gave me the, uh, the thing to get this. Because I do like this much better. <laughs> so I will be using this. I guess it came in three different cups, four different colors, white, green, pink, and navy blue. There's an informational packet in there. I don't need that. <laughs> so that, I think whoever told me about that one. Uh, more things for Polo. $1.80. I know Rob was like, you need to stop buying things for Polo. And I was like, I will not buy anything for Polo currently, but I cannot promise you that I did not buy 500 other things. So he has been loving... Things like this that had feathers on it that would get clipped to, usually you clip on a thing where you would make a wand, but we took them off the wand and he preferred them better without the wand than on the wand. So, I mean, he gave it a little once over. Let's see if we hear any bell. A little bit. And it comes with one, two, three. So we'll have four of them in here. Oh, he's playing with it. Uh, comes with one, two, three, four of them in here. Like I said, it was what? A dollar eighteen. So got that for him. And what is this? Is this something else I got for Polo? Jeez Louise. Why do you get spoiled, kitty cat? What is this? This is like, it looks like it was for $9.97. He's playing with it. This almost seems like it's for a friggin' baby. What in the holy heck was I thinking? <laughs> this just unties. Somehow. What is this? This is what I wish we had a bigger house, because, like, <laughs> where are we putting all this stuff? Maybe the other way? She'd be like this, right? How do I get it the other way? Ah! 
for babies or cats. I'm going to put it down and maybe we could get him to play with it. He's currently, ah, currently down here. One memento. Here he goes. Checking it out. <laughs> Look at all the cat toys all over everywhere. Spoiled, spoiled, spoiled. Is that your carrot? Is your carrot right there? Well, you're in there. Okay. You gonna play with something? <laughs> Hopefully nobody's bored right now. Obviously all those packages will get picked up after the video. If you care more about the string, wouldn't surprise me. I mean, it doesn't seem, it's not a fail. He's in there playing a little bit. And is he done? Play with something. Nope, I think he's done. We'll see though. Rob's gonna come home and be like, why did you buy a baby mat? A <laughs> baby play mat? Just to see. I mean, he might not play with something right this second. But later on today, when he's in more of a spunky mood, like now he's kind of in this like, come down, hang out, go back upstairs, sleep for a little while, back and forth kind of thing. So he's a spoiled cat. But obviously anybody that lives in my home is spoiled. So let's remove these butt things. Oh, there's another piece to it. Where is it? Gone, gone forever. I don't know. <laughs> Here's part of it. Is that the whole thing? I mean, that's the whole thing. So yeah, there are these little patches. This thing was covered in like goo. I don't feel any firmer. <laughs> All right, guys. So like I said before, this is the last of the orange. Next video should be the all clothing items under three dollars then i'm gonna try to do a clothing haul a month if not maybe two to get through some of this stuff i keep telling myself stop ordering melissa you have plenty to review but then i go on the site again and then there i am <laughs> i'll also review this at a later date too because i'm not in the mood right now <laughs> to cook any spam <laughs> So, like I said before, all the ones that are still available, the links will be down below. Also, there'll be a code and a link to save anybody, new and existing users, and get you a $100 coupon bundle. Um, I'm going to be clicking that also because I can always use coupons. <laughs> so, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you have any comments or questions, put them down below. Yeah, and yes, subscribe. Well, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you have an amazing day. I'll see you soon. Bye.